Hey guys, how's it going? GLE here, and well, <clears throat> it's time for part two of that Christmas haul I did a little while ago. <clears throat> yeah, that's a big fucking package from Ami Ami I got. Biggest package yet. So let's get cutting into it and showing you. Everything. Actually, I don't think I've had an unboxing this big since my very first unboxing video I did on YouTube, which was my first Hobby Wave order. So, yeah. Uh, yes, this is fucking awesome. Uh, okay, so let's start with the smallest of stuff and then work our way to the biggest. So, first and foremost, I got both the Fire Dragon and Hurricane Dragon Wizard Ring sets, which means all I'm missing is the Land Ring, and I have all the Dragon Rings. Now, um, I did get, a while back I did get a uh, Land and, well, a Land and a Hurricane Ring, but these are the uh, candy toys. I won't do actual full-on reviews of these. But uh, I will use them in the review of the uh, Dragon Rings. So, uh, but uh, I won't be reviewing these until the Land Dragon Ring come out, comes out. Because I want to just review all the Dragon Rings in one shot. So, yeah. There's that. Next up on the list... Uh, I'll, go with, I'll go with this. Actually, no. I'll save the model kits for last. I got SH Figure Arts... Pegasus Koga from Saint Seiya Omega. Oh man, me and Wheelchair 21 both like launched at this thing the moment the pre-order went up. And I'm actually really, really happy about getting this and I can't wait to actually open this up and see how it is. I've been keeping my eye on this thing for a while. I haven't really gotten uh, anime figure art in a while. I haven't gotten a figure art in a while actually now that I think about it. And um... I'm actually curious to see how uh, this anime figure art stacks up to the last anime figure art I got, which was uh, Cure Black and White Max Heart. Speaking of figure arts, I actually got another figure art. SH Figure Arts Ryuki Survive Form. This is going to go with my SH Figure Arts Ryuki. Yay! This thing, uh, this thing also looks nice. The only thing that sucks is you don't get a... Uh, Survive mode, drag redder, or drag redder's vi, or however you say it. So, yeah. Next on the list, um, I have Figma Skihi Araragi from Bake Monogatari, or, or more exactly, Nisei Monogatari. Uh, this is gonna go with the Koyomi and uh, Karen. Kinda sucks that they didn't use K's for all three of their names, but whatever. Looks like she also comes with the uh, holding hands, which is kind of weird because Karen came with those also. Oh, whatever. And last but not least of the figures, and well, actually that box is very nice. I have the Robot Damashi Lancelot. Oh my god, I freaked out when they announced this thing. If you... Unfortunately, you guys can't go back and watch the Tokwondo News podcast for when they announced, uh, when I talked about this, when they had announced it. But uh, you guys can at least, for those who did see it, you know how much I've been like waiting for this thing to come out. Oh my god, this thing like blows the Lancelot Albion out of the world. I don't have the inaction offshoot Lancelot to compare it with, unfortunately. But I will at least compare it with the uh, Lancelot Albion because the Lancelot Albion was an earlier one. And it did use the uh, in action offshoots uh, mold, kinda. So, yeah. Now, getting to the model kits. To start things off with, this thing right here will allow me to complete my trifecta of hell. I got the Figure I 6 Silver Crow. I own all three figure, uh, posable figure iterations of Silver Crow now. Yeah, I'm that sad. Uh, so, do expect a review on this thing because 
The only reason I even got it was just so I can literally have a silver crow. And so I literally, just because it was cheap, so I could complete all my silver crows. And now I have a silver crow that can pretty much do everything that need that silver crow needed to do. And st including having slight effect parts for his uh, special attacks. Main, the, my main reason for getting it was just that I can have a silver crow that looked like he was getting ready to deploy his wings. As well as a silver crow that could do the super death headbutt attack. Now, are the parts actually... I did this before in the la in my previous unboxing work. Yeah. No, no, no. Uh, I did this before in my last Ami Ami unboxing where I didn't actually show off everything because I had gotten one more thing, but a stupid me had opened the box from the bottom and I didn't see it in there. But yeah, they're probably inside the box space. But uh, time to get to Gundams with the high grade Universal Century Delta Kai Gundam. Now, uh, okay, I know a lot of people are going to start smacking me with hypocrite, uh, hypocrite criticism because I hate parts formers. Here's the thing, though. Uh, I got this thing partially for two reasons. Part one being something that's going on with me and Wheelchair 21 that we are working on uh, that this thing relates to. And part two being I like the design of the Delta, of the Delta Kai Gundam. And I have my doubts we're going to get a Master Grade of him. We'll get a Master Grade of the fucking uh, Delta Gundam before we get a Master Grade of the Delta Kai Gundam. Speaking of Master Grades, perfect time for a segue with the... Let me peel this off so I can see if it's in here. Master Grade uh, Blitz Gundam. And the special thing about this is... No, they're not in here. That means they are they are without a doubt in the box, so excuse me for one second. Oh, ah, yes, there they are. They we're hiding in there. Uh, what's special about this is, it's the... Whoa, I don't have one. Did I get... Maybe the second one is in here. The special thing about this is... Actually, there should be three things in here, so excuse me for one second while I peek around a bit more. is that this is the uh, uh, the Gunpla uh, Master Grade uh, the Gunpla Master Grade campaign thing so I get the uh, special colored clear parts the Vernier or what no HD HD lights I don't remember what all these things are but there's supposed to be three things I have a feeling that the third one is actually Digging around, yeah, it's not in here, so it's gotta be in the last things box, which let me get it out of the way now. Master Grade New Gundam Verka. Like you guys expected me not to get this guy. No, his the, the fucking thing isn't in here. The fuck is it? Uh, I'll have to get to digging around in that box more thoroughly, but that is pretty much it for my Christmas haul. This was bought with pretty much all of my Christmas money. Literally, every dime of my Christmas money went into this box right here. This is the biggest unboxing I've done in a while. I cannot wait to get into mess with some of this stuff. Ugh. First, I gotta dig through all this paper and find... because. Both of these were part of the HD campaign. So I should have, uh, along with getting the, uh, this and this, unless I'm wrong and it was, I get one at random to go with each one, but I thought I was supposed to get everything, I should be getting two, I should have gotten two of these, two of these, two of the hands, and two of the thruster bells. So, unless I'm wrong and I was actually only supposed to get one of each, I was only supposed to get one random one of each different one, 
I should have been getting two of everything. So I'm going to tear this box apart to see where the rest of these are. So yeah, that's about it pretty much. And just stay tuned for all this stuff. So I will catch you all later. Peace.